This is Gene Key, KDDD News. An Amarillo man's found guilty of reckless manslaughter in an accident that killed an Odessa man. Cameron Myers veered into traffic and hit 29-year-old Pedro Serrano's car back in July 2009. Serrano died hours later at the hospital. Friday, a Randall County jury found Myers guilty. He was sentenced to three years probation. A federal court in San Antonio has issued temporary redistricting maps to be used in next year's Texas primary and general election. But there won't be a lot of change for us here in the Panhandle. According to MyHighPlains.com, the biggest change will come in outgoing Representative Warren Chisholm's District 85, but mostly in number, switching from District 85 to 88. Representative Four Price and John Smithy's districts will remain virtually the same, while State Senator Kyle Seliger's district will expand by a few counties. The federal court redrew the state's districts after a panel of federal judges in Washington, D.C. decided earlier this month the maps passed by the legislature last term are illegal. Legislature maps discriminate against minorities, particularly Hispanics. Several Hispanic groups that sued against the legislature's map have not objected to the court's maps. A judge in Floyd Data has refused to return more than 200 neglected dogs to the owners. The Associated Press reports a Floyd Data County Justice of the Peace last Thursday ruled that Mark and Sandra Smith of Lockney had treated the animals cruelly. The Smiths were ordered to pay nearly $237,000 to Floyd County for the cost of caring for the animals, which were seized in late September. This is Gene Key, KDDD News.